Question number two says that arrange the following in descending order. That is, we have to start with the largest value and go on to the smallest value or the lowest value. So for the first bit, we have three fractions, 2 over 9, 2 over 3 and 8 over 21. But these three fractions have got different denominators or we can say that these three fractions are unlike fractions. So our first objective will be to make them or convert them into like fractions by having a same denominator for all three of them. And that can be done by finding the LCM for the three denominators that is 9, 3 and 21. The LCM for these three is 63. So to make the first fraction's denominator as 63, we will have to multiply 7 to the numerator and to the denominator as well. And that will give us the fraction as 14 over 63. For the second fraction, to have the denominator as 63, we will multiply it with 21 in the numerator and 21 in the denominator. And that gives us the fraction to be equal to 42 over 63. For the third fraction, which is 8 over 21, to get the denominator as 63, we'll multiply it with 3 in the numerator and 3 in the denominator as well. And that gives us the fraction as 24 over 63. Now, as 42 is greater than 24, that is greater than 14, which are the numerators that we have got for the three different fractions, we can say that two-thirds is greater than 8 over 21 and that is greater than 2 over 9. So this is the descending order for the first bit of this question. Coming to the second bit, again we have got three different fractions which are unlike. So we'll make them like by having the same denominator for all three of them. The LCM for 5, 7 and 10 is 70. So to make the denominator for the first fraction as 70 will multiply it with 14 in the numerator and 14 in the denominator as well. So that gives us 14 by 70. For the second fraction, we'll multiply the numerator and the denominator with 10. So that gives us the fraction as 30 over 70. And for the third fraction, we'll multiply it with 7 in the numerator and 7 in the denominator. So that gives us the fraction as 49 over 70. Now, as we know that 49 is greater than 30 and that is greater than 14, we can say that in the three fractions that were given to us, 7 tenths, that is 7 over 10 is greater than 3 over 7 and that is greater than 1 over 5 or 1 fifths. And this is how we can arrange a given set of fractions into descending order. To learn more about how QMath can help you crack school and board exams, explore QMath Leap, a live online classroom program run by highly experienced and committed teachers.